Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, thanks for stopping by. My name is Nahama. I make videos on life coaching and lifestyle, so be sure to stick around if that's something that you're interested in. I realized I forgot to do an intro and outro to this video, so I'm doing that right now. Welcome to baby's first flight video. I was actually super worried about how it would go, but it turned out amazing on the way there. As you'll see soon, she was so good. She really just cried a tiny bit when we changed her maybe and like maybe one other time for like two seconds it was it went so well she was pretty much nursing and sleeping and just chilling and i think she really liked the white noise on the plane so that was amazing but yeah let me just show you but wait, I wanted to say also that I didn't edit the video in a way that was just like, you know, quickly cut, b-roll, all looking nice and pretty. I did do that for the Florida video because it's just like an intro to the actual week in Florida. You know, the flight is just the intro. Here, the video is about flying with a newborn and really showing you how it was. And of course, just because it went smoothly and it went really well and better than we expected doesn't mean that it was easy. There's still tons of stuff to take and it was a whole, you know, it's a learning curve flying with a child especially a newborn and a four week old four weeks after giving birth it was quite crazy but we did go because my sister-in-law was getting married so i wouldn't have gone if it was just like a vacation i wasn't planning on going anywhere that soon after giving birth but i'm happy that we did and we learned a lot from flying with a newborn and i actually feel like we're more prepared to you know take her out places and it accelerated our growth in living life with a baby so that was a good positive benefit from the experience but yeah so i left a lot of clips in the video that are just like you know longer that have the sound on that you can just like see the process of what we had to go through to you know packing up her stuff and making sure she was eating and and warming up the bottle and all the different things that we were dealing with when flying with her tell you everything I've seen the friends I've made and then you tell me how you've been look a little closer it's been quite some time but you gotta let me know if I'm out of line but there's some words that I just want to say to put it all straight before this night turns into day And then I'm on my way Should I go on? Oh, okay. Honey, you could do it soon. Okay. You good? Yeah, well, really good to take it out. Right, because anyway, we're going to have to take it out. Yeah, that's okay. 
Failure to wear your face not to the ground is like correct life Captain. Get the feet in. Good job. Good job. Hey Joe. Uh, oh, now it started. What you doing? I'm feeding your baby. <laughs> segment of what's in my diaper bag. Her diaper bag, I don't even know how you're supposed to say that. Um, but I'll show you guys what I packed for her. And obviously I have no idea, I'm just, I'm just guessing. But what's cool about this bag is that it came with this changing mat, which is super convenient. This is my book, so just ignore it. Um, some wipes, we have a swaddle, we have these uh, mini headphones that I thought the plane was really allowed she could wear them. 
but she didn't really need it. We have this um, burp cloth. Um, okay, I have a little section here. I'd like to check this out. I have a little pocket in here of like my nursing creams and stuff like that. And these are the shields. Um, there's another pocket here that we put some pacifiers and what else is there? Oh, and the pacifier clip. What else is in here? Oh, we have, of course, the diapers in the front. I need two hands. Oh, thank you. Here are diapers, and then I have this nursing cover. Um, this was my first time breastfeeding in public, so it's quite an adventure. Good job. Out. Um, and yeah, that's in this bag. We still didn't rip off the tag, which is classic you. Yeah, it's cooler that way. I like to leave the tag on everything. I have no idea why and wear it that way. That's the way to do it. Style. Um, Culture. We also have the Miguel um, electric pump bag. That's what it comes with, which is so cool. We have like washed parts and bottles in here, and the actual pump in here. And then, last but not least, this little um, where did it go? Oh, here it is. This little storage bag. Uh, for the milk, which is awesome and so convenient for on the go. Comes with a little ice pack and then. So I had a battery almost. You can just um, store the breast milk in here before you're able to put it in the fridge freezer. So that's super convenient. And yeah, that's pretty much what we packed for her, other than her clothing and stuff like that in the suitcase. So. She likes Florida. Yeah? Yeah. Probably very bright for her. Honey, I need you to take the diaper bag, please. You'll get it all later. Okay. Thank you, Moshe. Oh. So you could have just changed her in the bathroom in the back of the plane. How was it? She was so well behaved and dry. I think in part we just fed her the bottle, so she's got nothing to complain about. Not <laughs> caring the world. Right? Not caring the world. Hey. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Yeah, we didn't take off yet. Um, yeah, everything's just going so smoothly and so well. Unexpectedly, at least for me. And... Should I 
first thing about the white noise, yeah. Yeah, it's probably good. Got a big burp. Yes, we do. Look at this hair. <laughs> you are so cool. All the latest fashion. Oh, I'm sorry I insulted you. Mm. Want to eat more? Okay, second course. <laughs> she is not amused. So as 
you just saw, the way back went really well also. Not as good as the way there. I feel like the way back, it was a little bit more, the feeding times were not, um, you know, as coordinated um, well. And maybe we were just more tired. It was earlier in the morning. I don't even know, but it felt a little more difficult. It felt like she wasn't as well behaved, although really we didn't really have any issue on the way there or back. If you are flying with a newborn or you're flying with a baby and it's your first time and you're worried, just keep in mind that it can go way better than you expect and really just having her baby bag, like her diaper bag with her basics is really more than enough and especially if you're breastfeeding it's easier in the sense that you can just, you know, breastfeed right there. It was also, as you probably saw, it was my first time breastfeeding in public, especially when it wasn't something I was very comfortable with yet in general. That was a little bit of a challenge, but it really ended up working out and it just throwing me into it made it something that I just had to embrace and I think it was really good for me. So if you're flying with a baby for the first time, good luck, you're gonna do great. Just take his or her basic things with you and hope for the best and hopefully it will really work out nicely. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys. Bye.